it is unfortunate to see people are losing devops jobs within 30 days of their joining in this video i will detail the mistakes made by them and how to avoid them the first mistake lack of skills some people are joining devops jobs even without having a skill without having basics that's going to be very dangerous that's the main reason why people are fired so soon after they get into the company how to avoid this simple learn take courses do preparation you don't have to spend entire 24 hours a day to prepare one and a half hours class one and a half hours revision and preparation and you don't have to spend entire day for this remember it is difficult to survive in a job without having basic knowledge the second mistake is understanding the requirement suppose your lead gave you a task to work on but you didn't understand the requirement because you don't have basics let's say you spent four days without doing anything about that task on fifth day your lead is pinging you on a communicator about the status of this task you are worried right you are in panic and you, you don't have real updates about the task because you don't know what is the task and uh, how to do the task now let's say you are reaching your friend to take help from them you shared your requirements with them and they realized the requirement is incomplete meaning we don't know exactly what to do with this task so now he will ask you to go to your team get so and so information from the team let's say you did it now team will be confused skeptical about you because task was given four days ago you're asking questions now why the delay of four days for asking questions there itself lots of doubts creep into your team's mind about you to avoid this when a requirement is given to you read it multiple times some people don't even read the requirement if they don't read they don't understand what has to be done right read it multiple times let's say you didn't understand google it put it in chat gpt still you didn't understand you go to your friends ask them to have a look they will help you with the requirements if it is incomplete they will have few questions those questions has to be asked to your team members go to team members post those questions to them get the information when requirement is clear it is easy to do mistake number three you must do lots of observation in initial days weeks and months you must observe how the team is operating what is the workflow which tools are used in the project and you should be focusing on getting access to the required tool if possible find documents about the project usually confluence pages where you can find lots of information about the project the technologies used in the project and lot of information you find in confluence pages that helps you understand the project better you must spend lots of time in initial days reading understanding about the team the technologies and uh, what all they are using in the project the fourth mistake the fear and hesitation to ask questions simple if you have a question just ask yourself is it a technical question or a question about the project related information the requirement related information if it is not a technical question don't hesitate to ask your team but most people what they do they panic to ask questions that is one more problem which is blocking you to perform the team so don't ask what is git branch what is uh, git commit they are technical basic questions don't ask such questions to your team you can ask your team things like hey i need access to git can you help me the process i need access to jenkins can you help me with the process 
hey, here this requirement, I need some additional information. Such questions you must ask, otherwise you will be in trouble. I hope this video was insightful. Try to avoid these mistakes and build successful careers in DevOps. All the best. Thank you.